Assalamu alaikum, welcome to another episode of Smile to Jannah. Don't forget to hit the notification, don't forget to subscribe and a like. Smile to Jannah. <laughs> The box office record setting Avengers. Cool, uncool. Because of what they called it, mate. Infinity War? Are you crazy? Are you nuts? Have you no shame? We all know the true Infinity War, mate. And that is the war in Afghanistan. The war with no end. And this Happy war is celebrating his 16th birthday. You. It's been going on for 16 years, America's longest war. And of course it's expenditure of over a trillion dollars. And of course, embarrassing war crimes. All to get rid of a people that you funded and supported since the start. Yeah, you heard me, you Netflix watching, fake food eating, Blind followers of the government and the media. Conspiracist! You're a conspiracist! Oh, really? Well, let's hear from the big dogs. We had this brilliant idea that we were going to come to Pakistan and create a force of Mujahideen, equip them with Stinger missiles and everything else to go after the Soviets inside Afghanistan. Still not convinced? Well, let's hear from what was said on the ground, mate. Because your cause is right and God is on your side. If that's not enough, a couple of days ago, General Robert Nella from the US Marine Corps. He called the Taliban apostates. And then he said, We are the Mujahideen. I didn't know that the general has been promoted to religious leader. So let's hear from Mullah Mufti Robert Nella. Damat barakatuhumul aliyah. They're apostates. They hide behind Islam. They sell drugs. They kill innocent people. That's not what Islam is. The Afghan army and, and the American, we're the, we're the Mujahideen. Trump is probably going to be the caliph. If you want to know more fatwas about Ramadan and Talaq, they'll be out soon. So stay tuned. We're the Mujahideen. Here's an article of our soldiers urinating on the dead. Is an article of up to a million Afghans reporting war crimes. Is an article of widespread torture there. Is an article of the American army being told to ignore child abuse. Because you've been very patient, here's a complimentary clip of George W. Bush, the then president who led America into Afghanistan. Here's a clip of him calling the war a crusade, which is clearly a link of the old war against Christianity and Islam. This crusade, this war on terrorism. And let's not forget the fact that he claimed God told him to do it. <laughs> you know, as you do, yeah. Just like the general has been promoted to the Mufti of Islam. I plead to Marvel, please guys, we need to promote Captain America. He's been a captain for too long mate. He deserves to be a major now. How many more movies does he have to do to be promoted to major? Why are you holding him down? Is it because he doesn't kill innocent people? And considering what an embarrassment the war in Afghanistan is, I'm sure America won't be sending in any more troops, right? Wrong apparently. Back to the question posed on the title of this video, I think the conclusion is Yeah! Sue him! There is only one Infinity War. Till next time guys, Salaamu Alaikum.